All right, I'm so excited. I just got in the mail my Zen Vivi quilt. So I'm going to show you how it looks. So I'm out here in my backyard. It is just a beautiful day today. It's about 75 degrees, no clouds in the sky. Taking advantage of it. Opening up my news and baby. All right, first thing here. This must be my the pad cover. Yes, or that goes over your um, sleeping pad. If we can see it. Ooh, it's super soft. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that. The material, hopefully you can see. The, sorry, my arm's in the way there. So they've got the cover here for your uh, pillow. First thing, I just can't believe how soft the material. It's just, wow, I'm impressed by that. Okay. Next, I ordered a couple of, oh, to collapse, I ordered the bag to put it in and squish it up. This all squishes it together. Um, let's see. Oh, the slip sack. Oh, I ordered a little sack of, uh, a dry sack, and then I ordered this little pouch just to keep stuff in. Let's see what the dry sack looks like. Uh, I think maybe I got a little too big. We'll see when you get it in there. We'll give it a try. Hopefully it compresses down. Zen baby! Alright, and here comes the best part, the quilt. Comes in its own little mesh bag here. It's got a nice little tie on it. Sorry if you can hear my dogs barking in the background. All the neighbor dogs are out talking to each other. Hopefully it's not too loud. Here it is. What I've been waiting for. A pretty little logo there. Zuzu? Nope, nope. Zuzu can't play on that. Sorry, my dog is wanting to join us. <laughs> All right. All right. Stay over there. Oh. Lay down. All right, so the yellow and the blue. And you go to the blanket. I know this isn't going to be exact, but. The clips, so yellow to yellow. There, you, like that. So once I get my air pad and I put it all together, get a better example. Okay, now I don't know where the blue went. Oh, green. So I got green now. It's fine green. Okay, so I lined it up just kind of, don't have my pad with me, but I wanted just to see how it looks. So you got the, the clips here, and then you got the side. So when you take your, your um, the part that goes on your pad, and you hook them. Sorry, oops, I think I'm upside down. There you go. You got yellow, then you go to the blue, and then you got your green. So then what it does is, like they were saying, that you don't get any drafts because it's hiding down inside. And then you've got that over your pad. Hopefully you can tell on that. So super cool design. Like everybody's been ranting and raving over on the, every review I've read. But I just want to talk about myself. So here's another one. Very cool. Then you got the straps that go over your mattress pad. See, and it has a little thing so you can tighten it up. Oops. So you can tighten it up if you need to. I'm loving it. 
So then the foot box. And then so like I said, it's super super soft. Can't wait to try it out on my first trip. Coming up hopefully next weekend. Let's see what this has to do. What I ordered. Oh yeah, see? This cute little zippered pouch. I love little pouches. Keep all my stuff organized. Now, let me undo it. Then, I do have to say, I ordered this back in February on a pre-order um, when they first came back out because I you know, hadn't been making it for a while. And um, so I had emailed them a week ago or a little after over a week and had said that, um, that I hadn't you know, heard anything. So they told me that if I hadn't heard anything from like middle early last week, that they would you know ship it two day to me, and I had just done like regular mail because I was telling them I was going on this trip. So I do have to say the customer service was outstanding because literally um, after I did that, after I emailed them that that I had it yesterday it showed up, but just now getting around to uh, opening it. <laughs> So they actually complimented me or um, instead of being just a regular mail, which was a week, they upgraded me to two day mail. So they shipped it on I think it was Tuesday and I had it on Friday. So I was very happy with that. So the website does tell you that if you order this quilt, supposed to go into a 10 liter bag so we're, we're gonna give it a try and see it's very poofy so and I know I haven't cut all the cords off so that's kind of getting stuck so so I gotta practice doing this <laughs> see me sh struggling here <laughs> I'm probably doing this wrong, so I'm sure if I post this and everybody watches it, then you're going to tell me I'm doing something wrong. But a lot of air. There we go. Maybe that will help. I'm sure once I get my collapsible stuff on, it'll squish it down. But. <laughs> Sorry, listening to me grunting here. Almost there. <coughs> Excuse me. So, okay, I got it in there. Yay! So, folds. I was I supposed to fold it first? Sure. <sighs> Maybe not. Okay, we'll just do this for now. I'm not sure if that's exactly right. All right, let's put on our toppers. Squish it all down. Again, I'm sure I'm doing this all wrong, but there's a little handle at the bottom of the bag too. You can see that. And another handle, nope, that's not a handle. All right, so I got the bottom on, got the top on. Now let's squish it down. Pull each of the straps, work its way around. Oops. It 
Let's see if I can get as small as the uh, ads I see on my when I'm looking online and it has it like really small <laughs> so far I'm doing pretty good like I said I'm sure I have it done so wrong somehow but I have to keep working on it but still I think it's smaller than my current sleeping bag which it wasn't keeping me cold enough or warm enough when it was cold out and I don't like to be restricted. I like to be able to move around. But, which is why I decided to try the quilt out. You know, I think I need to do some more and figure out exactly what I did wrong. But, I mean, you got the gist of it. It's small, not too heavy. Keep playing around with it. Now the only problem is what do I do with this? <laughs> do I just keep that in my bag or is this supposed to go in there too? Well, we'll figure that out another day. Now here I am at my camp spot for the night and I just got the cover over my pad so you can see how it fits. I'm going to get this situated all right all right so how you can see how it lays there how nice it looks fits perfect fits like a glove now I got my quilt put on just gotta latch everything up I'll do that when I get in bed And my pillow looks super cute there. Good morning from inside my tent. Just giving you a update on how I slept last night. The overnight temperatures were in the low 40s and that's the first time I stayed warm all night at camp. Zinbivy quilt kept me nice and toasty warm. I especially like the hood that I could put over my eyes to block out any light. Kept my head warm and I had plenty of room to keep my electronics. The quilt didn't move when I turned and rolled over in the middle of the night. It stayed in place and I had plenty of room to spread out the only part I would have to say that took a little bit getting used to was the snaps or the uh, hooks. It took a little practice getting in and out and getting those unhooked. But other than that, I have nothing but good things to say about this quilt. I'm very happy with my purchase and I do recommend this to anyone else who is looking to purchase a quilt themselves.